Yeah, we on Boss Talk 101. Yeah, we gon' talk, we gon' have fun. We be on fire, we be lit lit. It's a unique hustle, big, big. Check it, check it, check it. It's unique hustle. It's your boy ECO, and I'm here with the lovely, amazing official, Miss Jamaica. What's going on? Nothing, nothing. You know my dad, walk on. Why don't y'all stop what you're doing right now? Go like, subscribe, follow us on all social media platforms. I mean, our Instagram, TikTok, Snapchat, Facebook, YouTube, you name it. Even threads. You name it, we're on it. But if you want to find us, just type in Boss Talk Podcast. Anywhere streaming podcast is available and we're there. But if you want to see our, our full-length interviews or if you want to see any of our visuals, go to our YouTube channel, sign up for our membership. And how do you get to our membership to join it? is under each and every video including this one underneath click the description section there is a link that says join our membership click that link and join our membership follow the instructions because you all always ask us how can we support you that's exactly how you can support us join our membership it's only a little well i mean a little that's some change a month that but we so appreciate it okay thank you in advance yeah, man. Oh, man. Let's get it, man. We got my guy here today, y'all. He don't need no introduction. This guy right here, this is actually third time coming on the show, man. Maybe even fourth. I can't remember. He's been here, and we just was shooting hell. This guy here, man, don't need no introduction. He's solid solid as a rock, man. This my guy, man. Why is him Barrios in the building? What's, What's going up? on? What's up with the boss? How you doing? Man, I'm doing great, man. I, I, I usually not think the family going to be with you or something, but you come solo dolo. You still with him? Yeah, no. Nah, All right, sure. let me just yeah. go and put it out. Out nah, there before sure, we get sure. started. I want no problem, nah, nigga. Let's yeah, get yeah. and go on down through there, shit. <laughs> yeah. So how the, everybody good? Yeah, everybody straight. We just uh, you know, forking the road, but you know, we're gonna get past it. That's things happen. Man, you know, like I said, it's a lot we got to talk about before we even get into the music, man. Mm -hmm. I was looking at the internet, man, and my boy Kenny B. He signed for four years. Yeah, man, they take another dog from me, man. Yeah, he four, signed, have he four already years. left? Nah, he uh, he was supposed to leave on the tenth, but his judge granted him four more. To the 14th, so, so he, this this got to be, be federal. 14th, nah, uh, it's state, yeah. I think it's state. He had a little case. I don't really want to talk about it because I don't know, too, no, I, I don't know it. the inside but, details. But, of, but he had a little case of the situation, and yeah, he ended up getting out on it, ended up bonding out, getting in some other little trouble, and now you got to face it. So, I think he bonded out. He, he came over here, he was getting ready to come to an interview one time, and he made it over here. They followed him all the way over here and arrested him. Dang, for right real? up the street. And then they tried to say, Boss Talk 101, some little nigga on I'll never forget it. nigga Ah, mm -hmm. Try to say like Boss like, Talk done said some or something. Like, nah, we, said, like we set him up. What the uh, hell? Nah, you know because how, he how was we roll? You know Kenny. Look, Kenny it wasn't Kenny. It wasn't Kenny. Kenny, 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 Kenny didn't say it. It wasn't Kenny. It was somebody on the live. I seen it. I was like, what the hell they say? You know, they just be doing shit on But the only reason why he said that, you know, is because the day before that we was on live and he was like, Kenny, you got to come over here and do an interview. No, that was the same day. It was the same day. And then Kenny was trying to say what time is the And I told him to shut up. No, we have to tell you that. Yeah, yeah. I you you gonna hit him on a, you gonna hit his phone right. and give him the time. Something. Yeah. And but that's I, the reason why because he wouldn't stop. I don't think Kenny B think cameras is real though. That's like, what I'm saying. Like, he wouldn't stop talking. Like he one of them niggas like I like he don't like he, he don't feel like, people watching nah, like that. It, it, like just street nigga, bro. Man, I, nigga. I, I love love the nigga to death, man. That's sure, my little nigga, man. Like from the Yeah, but at sure. the yeah. end of the day, man. Uh, what don't kill you'll make you stronger, bro. Right, for sure. So, you know, whatever you're going through is for a reason and a Fact. season, bro. Fact. So I, I, I always look at that, man, and I'll be like, damn, man, you know, I know he got to go sit down, but watch when he come out how much he going to be done thought and figured out yeah. stuff on a whole nother level. And yeah. I think he probably going to see his most, his pinnacle moments when he come home. Yeah. You know what I mean? Nah, for real. So. That's what we, but. He he like he ain't he ain't never I ain't seen him I just seen him uh last night <laughs> to be honest but uh he ain't never moping around he ain't sad about it he taking it to the chin I ain't never seen nobody take no time to the chin like this like this this first time yes this, okay that's why I was wondering like, you know, it is his first he's getting a little trouble and you know yeah but week, first time week, actually going to actually signing for a time where you know right. you finna have to go sit down for some time yeah like man, bro he just motivate me like not on some motivate me to. Look at it like that, but like how a nigga can lose and still take it to the chin and just, you know what I'm saying, get up every day and just grind. You know but he young, though. Coming. He young, so it's not like he That's got he 40. Too, yeah, it's you not like he saying? got 40 years exactly. or nothing like that or whatever. Exactly. You know what he do his time. That's what he's sit saying. Down. Do my little time, come home. Good but time. he got to make sure when he come back home, he not in, exactly. into nothing. Exactly. Y'all know uh, Mad Max? His yeah, partner? Uh -huh. yeah, he kind of came home and got his head right. Okay, yeah, that's you know good. Yeah, so yeah, that's yeah, good. yeah. He told me he was coming home. You know what I'm saying he, he time took the NCG here. off his name and everything. He don't even go about NCG Mad Max no more. He just Mad Max. Really? That's Is good. he still doing music? Yeah, he still deep Mad Max on his way up. 
Actually, so he came. That's what I'm saying. He came I would have interviewed him. You, you, huh, you haven't? I haven't. Mm -hmm. I want to, though. Me too. He'll, 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 he'll I seen the last you. time on Big D the Mogul. R.I.P. to Big D the Mogul, man. Yeah, R. Mogul R. Media, R. man. R. Um, um, I, You know, I, I don't even want to talk about that because yeah. I'm still messed up by yeah. that. You know what I'm saying? I'm pretty sure a lot of y'all talk, talk, like, We talk daily. Yeah, you know what I'm saying? So, But really, though, know, when you think about just the guys that's going in and coming home, it's a lot of man. I heard your boy, uh, what's that nigga name? Uh, over there in Fort Worth, go yeah yo. They yeah. say he about to come on top of the year. Yeah. So that a lot of stuff is still rolling man, out here. They just here. took Freddie. They just took Freddie, but he ain't gonna be gone. He yeah, gonna be he, he yeah. gonna be back for like yeah, he never yeah. left. And, yeah. and it, that's a uh, that's, a, that's, a, that's, that's a, a hop skip and a jump. Yeah, that's a blessing. But uh, on the on, on the back to the tip, I want to ask y'all a question though, cause we, it's always on our end. Like we got colleagues, rapper friends, you know what I'm saying that don't you know what I'm saying might not be they go to jail or die or you know what I'm saying but like is it do it be the same feeling like is like y'all lost a colleague too or something like that like man I'm gonna be I mean like you know it's like we cool it's, with these guys but like it's you know what I'm saying like it ain't just like you lost your you know what I'm saying but it's still it's like still, cause y'all the same yeah, you know what I'm saying yeah. it happened to us all the time cause but when you think about it like no matter how it happened it always impacts me yeah because I'm a man that's trying to tell everybody about God right so when you come on this show, I'm trying to let you know God is real. And so I'll, let, I'll do everything else with you. We'll do the music, but I'm gonna let you know God is real. Right. So at the end of the day, when I lost 42 Live, yeah. that was the first person I ever was interviewing. And then the next time you looked around a week later, we texting and we talking about different stuff and then he gone. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. That, that was his, you know, that was something that hit me hard. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? And then you turn around and we lose, uh, uh, was it Walk Like Jordan? Walk Like Jordan first. Walk Like Jordan. Yeah, yeah. He was on here the same yeah. way. And then you like, damn. So all these relationships we're building with yeah. these people, me and him talking on the phone, he going back to L.A., him and Solo Lucci going back and forth, having differences, but then he cool with it because he understand that Solo like to do TV, and but we, we, but that's my guy, blah, blah, yeah. but we talking, bro. Yeah. Then he pass away like yeah. that. Then you turn around and you, you sitting around and you hear Strap, my boy, BFG strap, mm -hmm. yeah. boom. Long then you, strap, then, then strap. He he gets killed, and he was just on here, yeah. and I hooked him up with a couple of people. Yeah. Now you turn around. See, see what I'm yeah, saying? Nah, it don't real. stop. It bro. don't stop. Bro. Like you steadily seeing this stuff after time, after it time, after time. Yeah. On top of that, you hearing now Blake done got arrested, and he ain't, he might not be getting out. Then he get out a little bit, but at the end of the day, you still not comfortable yeah. with that, and that's family. Yeah. So it's like. Everything is just happening trifecta after trifecta after trifecta. Right. Not to mention people that I just knew from my hometown passing away. Yeah, I'll tell you this much, and y'all can take this to the bank. When you get over 35 years old, all you do is see people die and go to funerals. If you ain't one that's dying. Yeah. So you think it's tough now. Wait till you hit about 35, 40. You gonna do see number of people leaving this place, bro. Yeah. And some of them gonna be your same age, and it ain't gonna be from them uh, getting killed by no gun. It's just they just falling dead. Yeah. So you gotta figure out how to get your life right with God. That's the most important thing, and get your spirit right, bro. So your family will understand how to live and see something they see in you when you gone that can keep them going. Not for real. You know what I'm yeah, saying? Not for real. But now it, it hurts, tough. bro, and that's probably why I'm renting. But at the end of the day, all you can do is deal with. With, 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 with what you get, right. with what life gives you. You know what I'm saying? Yeah, for real. See, and we both look at things differently. I look at it like, you know, we're only here for a moment. No matter an age, death has no age on it, mm -hmm. right? So we are supposed to leave an impact on somebody somewhere for him. No matter how bad a per people talk about, oh, he robbed, he killed, he do. He treats somebody in his life good. Exactly. He makes some sort Not of impact real. on somebody else's life. Yeah. And whether somebody to look on his life and like, man, I don't need to go down that path because that's all it's going to lead to. And he saved somebody by that way. You yeah. know what I mean? Not for real. So everybody life leaves something on somebody else. So how I look on death now as I got older, because I didn't do this when I was younger, is what do I need to learn from that person's life? So that's my way of not making that person's life go in vain. Yeah. You know what nah, I mean? What do I need to learn? Sit back and really meditate on that person. Yeah. Everything that they did, whether you see them on social media or they actually had a personal impact on your life. Yeah. What do I need to learn? I love their hustle. You understand? Yeah. I love the way how he planned. Yeah. But I looked at the fact that 
you know, he had a lot of planning to, you know, because he told us about a lot of stuff he had in the works. But no matter how much man planned, God has the ultimate. Yeah, say so. Say so. But there's nothing wrong with planning. You know what I mean? We all supposed to plan. Exactly. Wow, man. But, you know, it's just life, bro. Let's get to the music, man. Yeah. Um, you always trying to figure out a way to make sure we get to hear your music. You know what I'm saying? Mm-hmm. And I, I I can appreciate that. I see that, and you still put it on Wardy's page too, yeah, right? Yeah, yeah, for Which sure. Which is so much love, man. Yeah, and they tried to low key. Well, I ain't gonna just say they, but like low key, like fans and like not, not even. I don't even know how, how I want to wear it, but basically, like it kind of the comments was kind of swaying me away because they was like. Well, what the music at? Well, what the music at? You know what I'm saying? But I, I gotta. I, that's why I started trying to. I, I got away from it. But Wadi would have wanted me kept dropping on his page. You so, gotta. You, know you gotta saying? do Behind it. what everybody saying. Yeah, so, you can't I'm go doing this it. for him. You're supposed so, to do you it. Know what I'm saying so. Man, let me just that. let me ask you about uh, just that that Aaron Rodgers man. You know uh-huh. you you sampled that Fifty Cent. It's easy to love me now. Yeah. Would you love me if I was down <laughs> yeah. and out? Yeah. Would you still have love for yeah, me, real. girl? Fifty Cent live on that one, nigga. Listen, you sampled that old, and then you drop bars on that whole yeah. man. Straight up the Texas way, man. Yeah. Straight up, you know what I'm saying? Just went out through there. Like, what made you set that up that way? Like how I do my how I do my real Prescott's and that's like our samples like I got it from Sorry for the Way how Wayne do his Sorry for the Way okay so um I, most of the time how I do it, I really do it trolling with my girl I'm talking about in the car playing old songs just singing them to her laughing in her face and stuff like that but I be liking them old school beats like you know what I'm saying and what I do is I I listen to it over and over and I have my engineer just put a my beat pattern on how how you know what I'm saying how I want to flow and we just run it like that everyone I hear that I want to go on. That's He's hard. Like that. Did That's 50 hard. Cent comment on it? Nah, nah, yeah. Not I yet. want to. Yeah. Yeah. It's going to be there. It's going to get there. I really, I really don't lot. be on that, though. Like, everybody tag 50 Cent. You know what I'm saying? I really yeah, don't be on yeah. that. Like, not that I don't want them to see because I do. But Shoot, yeah, I'll I be like, tag him. Be, yeah, I need to, though. I don't know why I don't be on that. You should. I, I, don't, I don't just be on that. Like, it be just music to me. I really be doing it for my fans because I ain't even want to drop no more sample tapes. Like, but everybody was like, bro, we want that. Like, we, you know what I'm saying? We like that. So. Yeah, do what your fans want. I cooked it up two weeks, two, three weeks, and gave it to them. Wow, who produced that? Like, who, who uh, My engineer, I got a, a few of them, but mostly on that tape, it was uh, his name, 2-4. 2-4? Uh, really? Yeah, oh, I should two, remember that. When yeah. I met him, his name was 2-4 before we even met. So really? That, that made us, That's a sign. That made us click like that. Man, I <laughs> yeah. enjoyed it, man. What he walked yeah. in the studio, he was playing some beats. What he said, nigga, what's your name? Like, 2-4? Like, nigga, I'm 2-4. <laughs> we locked, I swear to God, I can't even make this up. Wow. We locked in after that. And they be my engineer, him, Focus. I got... Uh, energy? Uh, I, I mess with Energy, but... Uh, I mess with Energy, but I don't know him. Like, I, like, like I talk to him through the DMs and yeah. emails and stuff, but I don't know him. I, I'm, I be trying to keep it down. I just seen him on that on that, on that one track with you. Yeah. Um, yeah. Uh, what about Impatient? Like, Impatient, uh, that's where uh, some of the song was in there, though. Yeah. Yeah. Uh, yeah, y'all, y'all did your thing on that. That's why I was talking about the golf course. Y'all oh, yeah, the video. Um, vi- video vi- who shot, did, by, who shot uh, by Who shot it? Visuals by D. Really? Yeah, my, one of my favorite cameramans. I got shout out D. You know what I'm mm, saying? Shout, shout out, out D, all my man. cameramans. That's but he, he one of my favorites right now in the city. And uh, I just I just be trying to be different, bro. Like, people, uh, me and Doe was having this conversation. We were shooting. He was like, bro, so what make you do this? Like, how you be? And I be like, bro, really? I just listen to the song and everybody think, Shooting up, a, 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 got to be a big budget, a big, thing, but you really just do it. Like, I called up there, yeah, I got a golf course, what time y'all, boom, set that up, went up there, you know, went and bought the little golf stuff, and we just literally, like, we rented out time at the golf course, and I brought my cameraman. They asked us why we got cameras and stuff, I told them I do YouTube, but that's how we did it. Wow, Man, I, like think that, that, I think like that. Everybody think it's some big thing, but it's really just, you just got to put, just do it. Wow. You want to mm-hmm. shoot a video at McDonald's, Pull up there and just do it, like yeah. you know what I'm saying. Whether yeah. they like it or not, so you might, you know what I'm saying. But yeah, yeah. Just do it, man. So, what do you think about uh, this? A little bit off subject, but I gotta go there because I always say it. I'm not gonna let y'all just come in here and not talk about things that's happening in the in the media yeah. and stuff. Like, what do you think about academics and the uh, Saucy Santana's uh, issue? Where they going back and forth? <laughs> I'm not gonna ask you this. I mean, like, we, oh, if, if, no, if you had a nigga like, nah, that was a big lie. nigga Yo. that was saying, "Nigga, I'm a, I'm a, I'm a box you," and he had some uh, uh, some fingernails on, makeup coming across, but the nigga on two times your size, but see, and I'm he a, say, "I'm a rock with see, you, nigga." A, when I see you, I'm gonna see you, nigga. 
And he and he that sexuality, he playing like he that? No, that's what he that's what, that's he what say. I'm saying. Yeah, yeah, but he say saying. when I see you. It's that. I'm getting to it. Yeah, like uh, and, I'm a, and when I knock you out, I'm probably gonna go up in your back. See, I'm a grown, I'm a real man. Like I'm a man. Like I stand. Like I like. Like it ain't no. I don't. I ain't against that. But I like girls, so I'm a man. So you're not gonna talk to me like that, like personally. But but academics, he he kind of teared up and it emotionally, he was like, I'm I'm gonna have to go back and forth with you. I don't want to be canceled by the LGBTQ. Because yeah. a lot man, of people please, have gotten canceled yeah, by man, yeah. Please they, leave they me alone. Please, too. please leave me alone, man. Yeah. And you know he crying. He don't want to lose. <laughs> <laughs> you know he won't lose his platform. Yeah, he got deals and all yeah, types so, of stuff. He got so, so what do you? What would you do if you was caught up in a situation where you was being uh, trolled, and they was really trying to come for you from that standpoint? How would you deal with it? Man, I don't know. Cause personally, me, I don't even see me getting there with them type of people. Like you know, I'm one of them dudes. Like like my 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 girl my my girl has friends like that. You know what I'm saying? But when they talk on the phone, I leave the room. It's nothing against it or nothing like. But it's just what I believe in. You know what I'm saying? What I stand. For. I don't even want to mix us up. Yeah, like my yeah. girl can't. We finna go out. Can't. I'm gonna stay there. You know what I'm saying? That's cool. Like I do. I do. I thing. You know what I'm saying? Mm. So. If one of them was coming at me like that, that was telling me how he gonna do this to me, and when he knocked me out, he gonna do I like I wouldn't see me engaging back either, cause it's just like I'm not gonna do that, man. Cause if you see me, you're not gonna do that. I think you, know you agree. Saying? I yeah. agree with you. Like I probably wouldn't even. Yeah, I, I don't on engage, it. I'm not engaging in that because now, I, I argue with a female, a real female, before I argue with somebody that think they're a female. You wow, know what I'm saying? wow. I, I had to throw that at you, man. I had to throw that at you when you when you look at. And I gotta say, I just heard Boosie going in again on 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 the fact of uh, his 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 mama, you know, was standing with the with the with, with the brother, mm -hmm. and that he not letting up on the situation. That he's gonna put that pressure. They forged his name. Yeah. They took his artist and they made money off of him. And he trying to get him. You know, he gonna yeah. take it to the max. Like I'm yeah. gonna lock you up. His yeah. blood brother. Yeah. What do you think about that? I wa I watch Boosie interviews like like a mud. So I I'm I'm into that like. It's 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 tricky because it's family, but they are. But when you when you when you when we join business, we we still family, but we got to put business before family because business take care of the family. You get what I'm saying? So if you running big, and then it's not like he trying to kill him or nothing like that. Like you, well, stole, he did run. He got far. out of the car yeah, with a bat. He did do that, but he he wasn't killing him though. He could have got out of the car with a a gun, a two two three. You been shooting at him five million dollars. This boosie like. I don't know. I don't know what he did, but what they say he did, like this, is supposed to be one of the baddest MFs around here. So it's just like, like you, you know what I'm saying. That's how you kind of gotta take that type of stuff. Cause at the end of the day, we all not doing it to make ourselves feel good. He wants his five million dollars. So the best way for him to get his, they probably spent it in all type of that. So the best way for him to recruit his five million dollars is to get. It. And then he got money. So like all that, like I feel like like he can try to do the gangster. Like oh, I ain't gonna snitch on him, you know, but like. Boosie, you a millionaire. Like, you know what I'm saying? You ain't really got no, you ain't really got no. Like, yeah, you got some to stand on because you boosie, but you ain't got to just, you ain't just, you know what I'm saying? Yeah, you ain't just. Well, let me ask you this. Do you think Boosie's wrong for the post he put out about Dallas, about he ain't coming, he ain't coming back here unless they're giving that 150? If they don't give him that 150, because he said they shot him in Dallas when yeah. he was on his live, he was saying that. Yeah. What do you think about that? <coughs> Needed 150 to come back. They shot that man. <laughs> I wouldn't come back nowhere. I got shot either. If I didn't know who shot me or why I got shot. Well, so you say you wouldn't go back, but he said for the money he'll come for the right amount of money he'll come back. For the right amount of money, I'm gonna come back because I'm gonna pay to pay to be protected this time for the right amount. You know what I'm saying? You send 150 or 50 up front or whatever he want. He, I'm pretty sure he gonna come back right this time. You know what I'm saying? He gonna be protected. Not even on the, oh, he coming back super duper. Now nah, I'm talking about security, the real protection, like mm -hmm. security, police protection. Like, that's probably how he want to come back out here because mm -hmm. he got shot. And it kind of messed him up, too, I heard. Like, he was, it did. He, he messed up for a little bit. Man, we love Boosie in Dallas, man. I like Boosie. I, 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 ain't, I ain't just going to cap and say I was the biggest Boosie fan. I was on Gucci and Future. And all man, that. no, I, was, I definitely, but. but I, like, I like Boosie, his personality Boosie and what his, a little his, bit, his story and all that. I Boosie like a little bit more close to being in Louisiana and the gut, the, yeah. just meeting him. I, I can relate to him a little yeah. more. I like Atlanta, don't get me wrong. And I love those guys down there. But yeah. when they come down to Louisiana and Texas and the yeah. way we swing, like. It's a little bit of closer connection. See, if I'm gonna go like old school, like I'm probably go like 
I'm out zero, slim thug. Exactly. Yeah, but still, like I said, you when I go, but but would you you? But I'm gonna have to. I'm gonna have to say Juve and all them too. I'm an older yeah, cat, yeah, so yeah. I'm not gonna leave. You can't. When you start saying slim, now you dipping back yeah, and yeah, to yeah. the to the skip and wacko and yeah. all of them boys. Yeah. You got to you got <laughs> yeah. to you got to feel me on that. You yeah. got you got you got some boys down there that was really getting to it when it come down to it. Like Lil Wayne, Juve, Manny Fresh yeah. was crazy on the beats. You yeah. know what I'm saying? Nah, for real. These niggas was stupid. So nah, for real. you got once you. Go down that lane, you can't even just stop. Nah, right I respect there. it for sure though. Like it's respected. It just wasn't what I was on. Mm-hmm, mm-hmm, you know what I'm mm-hmm. My big brother more so. My big brother was a Gucci fan, so we had. I definitely love. I yeah, met Gucci a few times. Gucci, like big, big Future fan. That's why Future my favorite artist because my big brother. So you going Gucci, Gucci instead of Jeezy? Yeah, for sure. Wow. Yeah, Gucci for Jeezy for sure. Wow, well, Jeezy, but Gucci hadn't come Jeezy out had with nothing recently. Run, well, Jeezy had Jeezy had a crazy Jeezy, run. That one when he my went, daddy used to listen nigga. to Jeezy. Young Zilla from yeah. the bottom of the mouth. You gotta, <laughs> man, yeah. you don't want that smoke, man. Yeah, you better leave yeah. that nigga where he at. Jeezy bad. That nigga knew how to do them ad libs real bad. good. Yeah, Daddy nigga, or Jeezy. I'm gonna say Jeezy. I like the way well no Jesus <laughs> talk about that dope man God do, do too, too. <laughs> but Jesus just a little bit better at it bro yeah. <laughs> Jesus a little bit better at it bro yeah. I ain't for the lie see Gucci might take you down rob you beat you shoot no, you Gucci was really a street he nigga though. Too, though, you hear me like I'm gonna tell you right now the trappers. difference I seen in that <laughs> Gucci was really doing time yeah Gucci was really having issues with different right. niggas on a whole nother level facing a lot of like like what we seeing Kenny B and all yeah. them doing right now. That's what Gucci was doing yeah. when his uh, hype during his highest times. Yeah. You know, uh Jeezy kinda, you know, he moved over to the right when 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 the BMF niggas start yeah. getting locked up, he say, Hell no. Yeah, nah. <laughs> I'm I'm not with all that. I'm a rapper. Yeah, I'm a rapper. I'm a rapper. 20 years, yeah. See what I'm saying? Yeah. And, and that's what you see. Yeah. And, and and then you you know, you look at God in them, you hear the stories, but them boys kinda stay crisp cr- clean. Yeah. You know what I mean? Yeah. They really real. wasn't, you know, they really wasn't uh, you know, just getting caught up in nothing yeah. where you could see it. Yeah, I like God. He give. I never he seen it. I money. never seen it. I never seen them where it was like, oh yeah. Until you know when the when, only time I heard of anything was when Do- when the Dolph situation yeah. happened and they would. This was before you know. I you didn't really hear a uh, yo guy getting his hands dirty yeah. like that. He kind of stayed. You know what I mean. Players, so, players, real CEO player, role. just doing his thing, yeah, you know. I, I like he doing role, now, really. Like, yeah, no, but yeah. he's trying to get back to that. He and I know I can feel he's trying to detach himself from all those stigmas. Yeah. That's why you don't really see him come out like he used yeah. to. Yeah, I always wonder why uh, a lot of these older rappers that y'all love so much, why they haven't came out with anything recently. Yeah, I'm gonna be. I'm, I'm a Birdman fan for all these niggas uh, you just named. Why they stop making music? I just think like music, one of them things like that, like. When you get older, you lose passion for it. So you and it's just like anything gets. Like I tell I tell my partners all the time. If y'all want to rap? Rapping is something you can get good at. Like if you go in there and you because I I wasn't good at it. You know what I'm saying at first. Like I ain't the best rapper, but I'm good. Up to me, I sound good. You know what I'm saying to my fans, my people, I sound good. So it's one of the things you just go and get better at. So I think like as you get older, you lose passion for it. So your your records don't sound. It ain't as much passion. In it. Now you got money, so you ain't got to. You know what I'm saying? You ain't saying? Like, you it's ain't, all about family. You at everybody that point. growing, and we all we ain't got too many. Like, we don't want to well, hear Jay Z get on there and talk about. You know what I'm saying? But you, you know, they send them niggas, man. Like when you look at uh, whether it be if you looking at say Gucci or if you looking at one of them niggas like Jay, yeah. some niggas being sent. You know, the J Coles or or, yeah. or just some niggas that's connected to yeah. them. They being sent. Yeah. You know, G uh, G's the only one I don't see connected to different people that he. Yeah. Usher not now. He did help with muscle on the beat YG back in the days. Yeah. He jumped on the track, and I think that helped the career out for yeah. YG a lot. Why you, you know? think he just wasn't help? yeah, he helping? Yeah, he was just helping niggas or like what? Well, you don't see the people that was with him at first. I've had a lot of them on this show, and, yeah. and they just don't. I mean, when I talked to Blood Raw, when I talked to Goldmouth, yeah. when I talked to. Uh, uh, it was one more Jody Breeze yeah. like you you can tell that they not connected the way they was before yeah. you know when it was going down but I hate them type of stories because yeah. it always looked like the person at the top was on some well you can't shit, really just say that I don't know but it the don't situation. even be like that all the time but it's just from outside looking in it be looking like that because first thing they say oh you got the money in you know what I'm saying but most it don't I don't know. It's just I hate them type. Well, of you know, that's you why at, I try to be with my at, same niggas. Say Ti and uh, Ti still got some of them day one niggas with him. Yeah. Uh, 
Um, when you look at Nelly, he don't have nobody that was with him. He with Ashanti now. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? <laughs> like all them niggas is mad over yeah. there and, and in St. Louis. St. Lunatic said he'll never do it again. Yeah. <laughs> never. I'm never going to work with him again, you know. But then BG said he ain't never going back to Birdman, and uh, he back over yeah, there. Yeah, he back over there. But he did. It's a song that he said, oh, no. I woke up to that BG. I woke up to that BG this back. morning. I ain't, I, yeah, Juve, that's my dog, but yeah. I ain't rocking like that. He was not going back. <laughs> yeah, for real. But now, see, time can heal things. You yeah. know what I'm saying? So, that's all it be. You ain't got to do it in the day. Some of just a conversation, like, right? Exactly. Some too much pride to have a conversation. So, like you said, time heals. Sometimes the conversation don't got to be had. It's just, mm. I miss you. You know what yeah. I'm saying? If I let, we can move past. It's over now. How do you think uh, Big, uh, no, no, not Big, uh, uh, my boy, what's his name? The little nigga that, that the little nigga that was rapping with Dolph. Uh, King Lock. King Lock. How do you think he's doing since Dolph not here no more? Let's be honest. It's, it's tough because cause it's like, like, yo, yo. Everything on you now, all of a sudden. You know what I'm saying? Most time, like I'm putting in football respect, you know what I'm saying? Something like that. Like if you got a senior quarterback and you the and you the you a junior or a sophomore, you get to watch your senior quarterback leave and you know he coming to graduate. So you you know what's coming. Death don't happen like that. You just wake up one day and, and he gone. You know what I'm saying? And now everybody expecting you to take the spot. What if you weren't ready to take it? What if you didn't want what if he had some other plans? And everybody throwing it on him. He doing good though, cause he got he back. You know what I'm saying? He got some. He, I think he got what they let's go song going crazy right now for sure. And uh, he got another song on the tape too that that's kind of going crazy. I be looking at the numbers too. Um, yeah, so yeah. Uh, he kind of he, he getting his, he getting he getting back in the groove, but that's that's a that's an L period. Cause besides him being his boss, his CEO, his you know what I'm saying, the guy that put him on. That's his. I think it was cousin or something like that. So, it's just, it's just well, wicked too. Well, what do you think about Rollo? He come out and automatically said, "I'm not gonna ever get with CMG because they you call Dolph gone." He pretty much that's came cool. out. He came out just <laughs> like that. For, I oh, seen man, it on Rollo, the blog. That's how he feels, that shit. nigga came out the first day. I don't know if that nigga was thinking about that the whole he time he was in there. That, the that time. nigga came out and said. I'm but not you know him rocking. money back yo had the little problem too though. I ain't even know. Well, I'm just money back yo had a little know. problem. I said, where this nigga come from? This like was he really? That's with? probably why he stamped it down so hard. But him money back yo had it. a little problem before he went to jail. Like it was a little video that surfaced about money back yo and him. But I didn't even know that. Yeah, it wasn't. I, don't I know guess it wasn't just that much of for me. I didn't see it. Yeah, you know what I'm it saying? Was a while ago too. But he sure came out like yeah, that. Did you see it? You seen that nigga came out with the Sprinter van behind him talking cash, nigga. I'm out. And I'm gonna yeah. let you niggas know I ain't doing nothing with Big CMG. White, I'm uh, like, what the hell is going on? Right like, yeah. Yeah. Come on. His first day out is crazy. Yeah. I can't wait to see the video. Yeah. What is this nigga saying? Yeah, he's he he always be like that on his songs though, straight to the point. I don't even like his music like that though, I, I, but I like him though. I like it. You know, it be like that though with some dude. I don't like his music. I don't really don't like his music at all. But I like him though. Like bump his music. I like I like him. You know what yeah. what I like yeah. the way he carry himself in the way everybody around him don't say nothing but good stuff so that's what I'm talking about man when you think about just uh, a nigga to come out on that first day out if you really want to stir that's some how you stuff stir up so, yeah. <laughs> yeah he come out like nigga I'm a hero raw yeah. raw nigga yeah he what y'all like. niggas think about this yeah, and like everybody else wasn't saying nothing you know what I'm saying yeah. Um, I want to talk about uh, See a Star uh, Produced by uh, uh, Energy the one I asked you about I, uh -huh. I, I wrote that down in my notes like what um that was about that was a year ago, wasn't it? Yeah. Like like from that to where we at today with like Aaron Rodgers, mm -hmm. what do you think the difference is in the in in the in, in that why is in Barrio brand? Uh in the music, I don't think it's too much of a big difference because you know what I'm saying? I'm, I just think like I'm growing up type, you know what I'm type thing, but uh I just think I'm just I'm just growing as an artist, as a person, as an individual type. But I don't really see the like on the tape I just dropped. Like I said, I kind of went sorry for the weight Wayne. So that's all samples. Okay. So I'm just giving you straight bars and you know what I'm saying. And see a star more of us. You know what I'm saying? It's, it's more about me type type stuff. And then I got Lorenny on the remix. 
on us. That's hard. Start, that's yeah. hard. That's hard. Run. That's my dog. That's hard. That's hard. I like that, man. I love to see you guys coming. I got to get him on here. I never had him on here. Right, that's my nigga. You know, tell yeah, him, man. I call, hey. call him when we get out. Say, hey, man, boss talk. You probably need to go over there. Them yeah. niggas is over there having a great day. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> yeah. He going to pull up on you for sure. <laughs> but He's a good nigga. He going to pull no, up on you for But sure. I definitely uh, enjoy he, he, To his flowers, he want to really, like, he ain't charge me nothing for the video. He, uh, it's my song. I'm talking about uh, Wraith in the Stars. He called man, rent a Rolls Royce on his own, had a Rolls Royce pull up. Wow. He ain't charged him nothing for the video. T told me, sent him way more. We got way more music. Like, I ain't, it, niggas out here not doing that with his type of stature in my city. You know what I'm saying? Like, and I ain't even from Fort Worth. He just put, like, just fucked with me. You know what I'm saying? That's love, man. Nigga, like, but we from Texas, nigga. Yeah. Yeah, that that they're like big extra plugs. Say, nigga, we from Texas. Yeah, <laughs> see, you know? now, now that you got to ride with yeah. that because nah, that's a big, real. that's big. Yeah. You know what nah, I'm saying? How do you feel about big extra plugs? This is probably gonna be my last he's question. Like doing his thing, he doing his thing. Shout out to him for sure, cause he another one that like um, we did the feature. You know what I'm saying? I came out some bread. He ain't charged me too much at all though. Like really locked in it through my visuals, but from that like, and this is the thing I want to say too. Like artists that. If you pay for features, I'm not saying like hey, you gotta pay for feature or whatever, but that feature could lead you somewhere. I'm not mm -hmm. saying go crazy, spend five, ten thousand dollars, because you know what I'm saying, who got that type? That's that's label money. But if you got an artist in your city doing his thing, respect this hustle, because you're gonna pay the weed man twenty five hundred for a bowl exactly. or whatever, you know what I'm saying? Exactly. So respect this hustle, because when I ask, I feel the same way when they ask me, when niggas ask me for free features, like give them five hundred thousand, you know what I'm saying? Like respect my hustle, but I respect this hustle and and his feature led me somewhere else. You know what I'm saying? Man. Led me to some more ones. So. Free Shout my boy Wyatt Barry. Uh, um, not you. I'm sorry. What's Blake? that nigga? Nah, no, I'm not Blake. Blake. What's the nigga name? Flip. 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 Yeah. Yeah. He posted it. That's who we just talked to, right? Yeah. That nigga lied to me. <laughs> <laughs> that nigga supposed to have me some music back over here. We be, be going up now. He don't want to listen to me because I didn't even know he you was told weird. Him. I was going to go to jail, but I, bro, I was... You trying to, to tell him, tape. you? We supposed to have a tape and everything, and they locked up here and had no music. See what I'm saying? I and he was over in line to me. That's what he was doing. He did more interviews than anything. <laughs> yes. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> the nigga yeah. over here sitting with me. Now he should have been in the studio with you. You wasn't coming. I mean, he should have. We had him. it mixed up. Don't care about We're gonna get it right shit. this time, dude. They, nah, he supposed to be out here in a minute. He do. He he too talented to not to not care about it. So when I see Flip him tripping. getting that mode to where he don't care about it, because he better than me. So when I see him getting that mode to where he don't care about it, I be like, bro, I be wanna punch him. That's my that's my real. I like when we got the same moment. That's my real brother. So we didn't. I really be want to get at him because. <laughs> Bitch, you holding us back. We supposed to be somewhere. That's it. I got a question. Oh, you okay? So every time when we ask people, it was like, okay, who's blowing up in the city? Who's big? Who's get, growing? Everybody say YSM Barrio. They uh -huh. sure do. Okay, so for as long as you've been doing it, I'm thinking that you should already been all the way up here. Right. What's holding you back? To be honest, a lot of these niggas got a hood behind them. You know what I'm saying? I ain't no lame nigga, but I'm not from the hood. You know what I'm saying? I'm from Duncanville, the woods. Mm -hmm. You know what I'm saying? Now, everybody grew up different, so I lost my dad, so it kind of made me tough. And, like, I'm not green, or I ain't going for, you know what I'm saying, a lot of shit. But a lot of niggas got hood behind them or make them look tough, you know what I'm saying? And I'm just trying to bring, I'm trying to come at it a different way. Like, I do a lot of dancing and shit. Like, I make rap fun. Mm -hmm. And out here, they don't like that. Mm. They don't like that. They don't want to bring it back to... You know what I'm saying? I ain't say we gotta go back to the boogie area because that's a different type of music. But right, I make rap fun. You can ask all these niggas at my videos. We f we having fun. But it's the same thing with um, social media or blogging. People go for more of the drama as much as they yeah. say, "Oh, you messy or you this or you that." Yeah. that's what get all the views. When you post good stuff, yeah. you get maybe a hundred, two hundred views. But when yeah. you post like crazy stuff, that's yeah. why you see uh, people out here doing the most, or even rappers, female yeah. rappers. Saying the most because yeah. that's what get the views. Uh, um, they just said something on um, Dallas Globe the other night. They was talking about all oh, Dallas rappers suck. Now I know I could have, I, I seen a few rappers, you know what I'm saying, in my lane say something about it. You know what I'm saying? I know I could have said something and probably boosting my live or boosting my. But I just ain't, I don't, re, I don't know, bro. I'm different. Like my people ain't right. Like, like I said, my daddy raised me all the way till he, I was 14 and he passed. Mm -hmm. Then my mama took over what she could do, you know what I'm saying? So I'm just different. Like, I don't let a lot of stuff get to me. Like, mm -hmm. I'm not with the, I'm not trying to, basically answer your question, I'm not trying to go out here and, and do, do something stupid crazy, to get, right. you know what I'm saying? Because I just feel like I'm an authentic nigga, so I don't got to. Like, I'm going to win regardless, whether it be in this music, in life, or business, you know what I'm saying? It's just a step. 
It's real. Uh, but then even like um, people, people listen to music to relate to it, uh-huh. right? And with you, I see because you're a father uh-huh. and you're a son. Yeah. So do you put a lot of that in your music? Yeah. I mention I shout out my daughter all the time on music because she be right there when I be recording. So <laughs> it's easy hard. to shout her out. But yeah. Man, thank you for coming on the show, man. We always love having you, and yeah. you always can come back. You ain't got to stay gone so long. <laughs> you got to pick up the phone and call a nigga. Your nah, biggest problem you. is not building relationship with the right nigga, which is me. Yeah, not for real. You supposed to be calling me. You ain't checked in in like six months. That's my bad, Probably about too. three months. We can, we talk, we said that we were going to do it one time, then we're like, we didn't do it. You hit me up, you like, I'm ready. I'm like, I, I'm going to go out of town. Yeah, nigga. Yeah, you going to yeah. call I'm me before. Shit, no. you know what I'm <laughs> <laughs> but that's all right. We're going to get it, man. We no, love you. I appreciate it ain't going nowhere. This, y'all always y'all, y'all, this always y'all platform. No, Ever sure. since Water 2 Live came first and paved the way for everybody yeah. else, y'all always welcome I appreciate here. y'all for having us. Man, come on, man. Y'all treat us like family. Y'all is family, though. Y'all family all the So Any time. And we coming up here and set these cameras up, man. For real. Appreciate I've had yes, sir, Treat man. Treat us like that. You're always going to get that love. Yeah. It's been another great segment of Boss Talk 101. Where the, the bosses, bosses talk. talk. And we out. Anybody.